As you may already know, last night Nvidia founder and CEO Jensen Huang announced that their much anticipated 40 series GPUs are on their way. During the GTC keynote speech, Jensen unveiled the third generation of RTX architecture, Ada Lovelace, named after mathematician Ada Lovelace, who's often regarded as the world's first computer programmer. First to be announced was the new heavyweight champ, the GeForce RTX 4090. The ultimate GeForce GPU delivers an enormous leap in performance, efficiency and AI-powered graphics. Also announced was the GeForce RTX 4080. The RTX 4090 comes with a whopping 24 gigabytes of G6X memory to deliver the ultimate experience for gamers and creators, whilst the 4080 comes with either 16 or 12 gigabytes of memory. Ada Lovelace Architecture also introduces DLSS 3, a new AI upscaler that generates entirely new frames rather than just pixels, boosting game performance by up to four times over brute force native rendering. Because DLSS 3 generates new frames, it benefits both GPU and CPU limited games. Ada Lovelace also introduces 3rd gen RT cores, 4th gen tensor cores, plus the shader execution reordering known as SER, which enables the GPU to reorder RT operations on the fly. For video, the 4090 has dual AV1 encoders, making exports two times faster. The GeForce RTX 4090 officially launches on the 12th of October and will of course be available at scan from this date, stock permitting. We will put a link to our dedicated landing page in the description for you where you'll find a selection of 4090s and a notify me button. So be sure to click that to stay informed of when stock arrives. This will change to either order or pre-order depending on stock levels from the 12th of October onwards. The RTX 4080 will then launch in November and will keep you updated on the specific launch dates. So why not tell us in the comments what you think of Nvidia's announcements and these new 40 series cards. And of course, when we can get our hands on one, we'll have a more in-depth video, including benchmarks. So make sure that you're subscribed so you don't miss that one.